Namibia 2022 car. She sharply, gracefully represented Namibia at the pageant and left the competition in its early stages. But nevertheless, she still made Namibia proud and she's joining us now on the line to talk to us about her journey. But very good evening to you, Cassie, and thank you so much for making time. Good evening. Thank you so much for having me. Mm -hmm. uh, firstly, just briefly, Cassie, just talk to us about your journey to Miss, Nam to, to Miss Universe. Um, I, I'm sure everybody wants to hear it. Yes, the, the journey to Miss Universe has been nothing but a great blessing in terms of the experiences I had and the network I built. And it's safe to say that the world knows about Namibia. And it's simply just because I carry my nation with so much pride and dignity. And I stay true, my, true to myself throughout the whole process. And it's all about putting in the work, staying consistent, and reminding yourself of your why. At the end of the day, I never got into pageantry just for the glitz and the glam and the title, but I got into it because of the upliftment of my country and the people. So the journey to Miss Universe, it was a blessing, not just because of the opportunities, but because of the support I've been receiving from the Namibian people. And yes, it has just been constant accelerating growth, yeah. We understand that you shared a room, or rather the Mr. Africa and Davi Nokeri was your, your roommate during your stay uh, in the States. Uh, talk to us about that and what did you learn from her? It was, it was so divine. It felt like home was with me all the time. She's such a beautiful woman with such big dreams and goals and aspirations. And we, we related on so much and we could really learn from each other. And whenever we had a busy day and we came to our room, it felt like we were just at ease because we were so comfortable around each other. It never felt like competition. It just felt like we were completing each other throughout every single day. And before we were delegates and we started off being friends and it feels like we're sisters now. And... And Davi is someone that has poured into my cup and I have poured into hers, and we have actually established a lifelong relationship. Mm -hmm. I'm sure there were very big moments uh, during the Miss Universe pageant, but what was the one that stood out for you the most that you will uh, forever carry with you? The one moment that stood out for me the most is just the... It, that stood out the most for me... It's just how everyone embraced Miss Namibia, and I made an effort to really invest time with the people that were part of the production and part of the, the talent, and it was, it was beautiful to witness that everyone was just welcoming Namibia so beautifully, and it was the people that were putting in the same work. Um, I told them, I would always just encourage them, you know, all of us under this roof, we are working within our passions and working towards one common goal. And that was beautiful for me. Mm -hmm. Awesome stuff. Uh, now, you still have a few months as, uh, as Miss Namibia. Uh, care to share some, what, what some of your plans are? I'm actually working on a very vigorous project um, where I will be going to different pediatric wards within the hospitals around Namibia, and I will be painting murals. I'll be repainting murals in the pediatric wards through my nonprofit organization, mm -hmm. the Honeycomb Haven Foundation. And I'll be establishing myself as the brand Cassia Sharpley. And I'd actually like to invite any corporate companies, any schools that would like me to speak at the events because I'm also going to embrace that avenue of life of being a public speaker and a motivator since I have a passion for that. And I'll also be pursuing my Bachelor's of Emergency Medical Care. All right, Cassia Sharpley, thank you so much for your time, and uh, we wish you all uh, the best for this year. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for having me, and thank you so much to the Namibian people for your endless love and support, and I cannot wait to invest more into my beautiful country for the rest of my reign. Awesome stuff. Much obliged. Thank you.